and welcome back to Skyrim. Last time we wound up killing, what was it, Elaine Dufont, I believe it was, and we, yeah, we're here in Morthal, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh yeah, we're here to kill, we done killed an orc. I remember now, we killed an orc. Luberk, Lerbuk. Now I gotta go kill a hern at the Half Moon Mill. Which is, I believe, in the Fall Creek Hole, actually. Yes. Hmm. Glenmoral Cavern is a little out of reach, but the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary is not. So let's get it. I'm the Dark Seraph. I didn't introduce myself. I forgot to introduce myself. Brilliant. I guess it doesn't really matter. There is murder afoot. So let's go kill a vampire. Does somebody wants them dead? I mean, they're... These are actually... Not all vampires are evil. Some of them are just trying to live in peace. Trying not to lose control or whatever. That's pretty much what this cu couple is doing. Just running a mill. Doing an honest, doing some honest work. And... Yeah. I'm just going to go flat out murder them. Because somebody wants them dead. Hey. Gotta pay those bills. Even though I don't monetize these videos, because I don't know if I gotta pay for AdSense or not, and I don't know if it would, with what little monetization I would actually get, would ultimately be worth it in the end. It doesn't matter. Wait till I get a bigger audience, and then I'll monetize. Why not? Let's just keep moving. Uh, you have to forgive me for being a little loud. I'm wearing headphones, and they're noise-canceling for the most part. It just keeps the... It, it, this way it keeps my audio from echoing into the microphone and sounding a little weird at some times. It doesn't always happen, but louder points of dialogue will be picked up on my microphone. I've actually... This is another recording session I'm doing today. Like I said earlier, I actually ordered some better recording equipment, which will be here tomorrow. But be I'll, be I'll be using it for a while before it actually gets progress done. Chicken. Unlocked. Keep your hands here. to be in here. Well, now, what have we here? A lost little lamb. I know. Ah, so the Brotherhood has come. This is highly overrated. Okay. No more witnesses, so... Nothing. Scaled boots and... Scaled armor, which is technically better, but... You have to remember. Oh, you can have that. Oh, you can have those as well. I know. Disenchant those. I'm gonna disenchant that and that. But yeah, all this extra stuff, it is better. So it makes it better. So now I can have the run of the place. Mammoth Tusk, I'm gonna need that for another quest. Some Nord Mead. Tankard. Carrot, 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 carrot. Yum. Boots, boots, duh. 
hurt. Chicken. Now let's head back to the dark, to the sanctuary. Like so. I think I'll go pay the Greybeards a visit. Might as well get that done with. it a little loud. I might need to turn that volume down. In fact, I'm going to do that. As much as I like the music in Skyrim, the music can be overplayed. I turned the voice up and all oh, that's fine. Turn the music down a little bit. That's better. It's not blaring in my ears. Hello, Astrid. We need to talk. What is it? Look, something is happening here. I'm not sure entirely what that something is, but... Well, we need to find out. If the Night Mother really did give you an order to talk to a contact, we'd be mad to ignore it. Oh, yes. And I think we'd both agree. Cicero's brought quite enough madness to this sanctuary. Oh, absolutely. So go. Go to Volenrood. It's a crypt, pretty far to the northeast. Talk to this Armand Motier, and let's see where all this leads, hmm? Okay, but first, I'll do that later. Brother? Sister? Abjorn? You can do better than that. Don't take offense to the... <laughs> The listener wants my counsel. I thought you were above the opinions of mere mortals, now that you commune with dead old women. No. Okay. Take care of yourself, Beefrost. I love how he calls you that. I don't know, I just think it's kind of funny. It honestly... I know it's just a nickname, I know... It just honestly... Kind of makes it feel more... Like a family, I guess. You reek of death, my friend. You may be the listener, or you may just be a lunatic who's started hearing voices. Maybe it's both. Either way, Astrid is still your mistress, not the Night Mother. Right. Pern is dead. No sarcasm this time. But I like sarcasm. Vampire, and live to tell the tale. Well done. And if you contracted Sanguinari Vampiris, be sure to get that taken care of. I have nothing to worry or about that. End up like our own Babette. Unless, of course, that was your goal all along. Here's your payment. Lerbuk is dead. Wonderful. The only good bard is a dead one, as far as I'm concerned. All that singing and mirth. Okay, your payment, then. as per the usual. Thank you. Any more contracts? Well, aren't we the eager one? Sorry to disappoint, but there's nothing. Try me again later. Okay. Well then, let's go chat around with the others. Uh, Babette, hi. It's my target's making a mistake of not perceiving me as a threat. Last mistake they ever made. Any advice on my current contract? The man you need to speak with, his name is Motier. That's a very old and powerful Breton family, firmly established in Sierra Dale. Most curious. Yeah. Right then. Gabriella. Make it quick. Any advice on my current contract? If the Night Mother truly spoke to you, if you really are the listener, your destiny was written in the void. Astrid is right to fear your power. Ooh, that's a bit cold. Kill well. 
Or can, can I use this, please? Thank you. Disenchant. I could disenchant that. I'm going to. Get some enchanting up. That is one of the... Yeah. Explorer's Guide to Skyrim. Uh, okay. Apprentice's assistant. Whatever. Sold him. Where's Festus? Uh, he's probably at the alchemy table, actually. Yes, hello, Festus. <laughs> Nobody ever expects a fireball from the darkened corner. True, but that makes a lot of noise and draws a lot of attention. So you're the listener, eh? Yeah. Well, that hardly seems fair. You just got here. The Night Mother should have spoken to me. Any idiot could see that. You know, I kind of like that. I will serve gladly as that small... Uh, why? Well... Now yeah, anyone would be upset, dedicate oh, years of service to something, an and the new guy gets everything. Infested with Draugr, so plan accordingly. Plan for murder, gotcha. Till next time, brother. Yes. Well, then. Hmm. Yeah, if anyone's going to be committing murder around this place, it's going to be me. So let's go deal with the quest in Vindhelm, because... Well, that starts a chain of events to where you can buy a house in... Ooh, Ruby. To where you can buy a house in Solitude. Or not Solitude, Vindhelm. And yes, not Wind... No, and yes, it is pronounced Vindhelm. Not Windhelm. Hello, Vizara. Mm -hmm. Any advice on my current contract? I'll, re I'll reiterate on the Vindhelm in a minute. Just remember Astrid's commitment to her sanctuary, to her family. A family... It now counts you as one of its own. Honor Astrid above all others. I can respect that. Until next time, brother. Anyway, it is pronounced Vindhelm. Because in the Germanic language, which the Nordic and Scandinavian language are based off of, the W is to act as a V. So it is, in fact, Vindhelm. And the V is to act as a W. So... Make that what you will. V and W are interchanged, but only in certain circumstances. It does not apply to Whiterun. Because I don't know why. Germanic language is weird. And like I said, there's no rush to actually go do any of that. Boethia is the Daedric Prince of Deceit, Conspiracy, and Secret Plots of Murder. Many Dark Elves consider him, her, to be their god, ancestor. Boethia has taken the form of both man and woman for some reason. So, no one knows if Boethia is truly male or female among the Daedra, unlike Mafala or Azora, who are clearly female. Hello! Hey, you're the one who killed Elaine de Font up in Ralvathar. Oh, yeah. Word about that got around. Man was a piece of bandit trash, is what I hear. And he gladly suffers in his fate. In oblivion, the light void your armor means light on your feet. Smart. Thank you. Okay. Aldrich won't give us a straight answer. He's a true yeah. lord. He'll come around. Just yeah. I'm not much of a strategist, but Lord Ulfric listens to my counsel all the same. These are difficult times indeed. Yes. My men are stretched thin as it is. If you offer your aid, I glad. I'm happy to lend a hand okay. as much as I can as well. He's against us. If you have any news of the Western Poles, take it to Ulfric immediately. How long are you going to wait? You terrible shame what happened to those women. Travel safely. Hello, Jarl. Only the foolish or the courageous approach a Jarl without summons. Do I know you? I was at Helgen. Ah, yes. Destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. I was set free. I could have gone anywhere. I came here to fight the Empire. 
A fair point. Well, you've come to the right place then. Speak with Galmar. I'm always looking for able fighters. Not everyone can say they made it out of Helga. Seems we're all branded villains these days. So long as your criminal past stays in the past. And you fight for me with honor and integrity. We'll welcome you into our ranks. Awesome. His city and leaving him in disgrace would make up I'll do that later. Statement, don't you think? So we're ready to start this morning. Need to investigate the crime scene. Lots of murder and mystery. Hello. I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Okay, I'm gonna go in depth on this. The term arrow in the knee is a Scandinavian term for marriage. So the guards got married and settled down and took to more stable and safer work. It makes sense. It's interesting idea. Your life has granted me permission to aid in the investigation. All right then. I noticed a trail of blood. Helgard's taken the body into the hall of the dead to prepare for burial. She's a little crazy. If she knows anything, it's dead bodies. Okay, so follow the blood. Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. Yeah, but that's not what I'm in, it's not what I'm caring about right now. Just a blooded trail just sort of ends here. Ooh. I'm right behind you. You lead, I'll follow. Okay, so it leads to that house for some reason. Dunmer get their drinks at the new Nissis Corner Club. Why they can't just call it a tavern is beyond me. Hmm, that's interesting. You see, not all the Nords and Windhelmers are prejudiced. Stay out of trouble, Imperial. How do I get in here, Om? Bring your Shadow Shield's old place. It's been abandoned ever since she was killed. I think her mother, Tova, has the key. Thank you. Mm -hmm. House the clan shatter shield. Okay. Oh right, I, I have the key. And because I entered with a key, they won't the guards don't think anything of it. Hello? Is anyone here? I just want to talk. Oh my god. Tova's farewell. First Frigga, now Nelsine. How can I bear the loss of a second daughter? when I'm barely over the death of the first. I simply cannot find any reason to continue, to continue living. My two little girls are gone. The light of my life has been extinguished. My only hope is to be reunited with him in the halls of Sovngarde. If the et et Eternals can suffer, they the company of one who has taken her own life. If not, whether my soul may end up in oblivion or elsewhere, has to be better than this terrible existence. Farewell, remember me fondly and often. Tova Shattershield. Rest in peace. Unusual Jim! That kind of killed the mood, I know. But that's honestly kind of tragic. 
She will only kill herself if you kill Nelsine. It's kind of tragic to think about it that way. Huh. Hmm. Some spilled bottles and containers of meat, a tankard. A chair is stacked on the bed in odd fashion. I forget what I'm supposed to be looking for. Screw it. Let's go to the Hall of the Dead. Or is it through here? Yeah. Okay. Bloody chest. Pushed against the wall recently. Walker attacks. Ah, secret. That's what you want to look for. Oh, my God. Butcher's Journal number two. Soon. Okay, I cannot wear I cannot wear the headphones and work with it. Very uncomfortable. Will you come out of there? Oh my god, why are you so stupid, Lydia? Hello, God. I have to wonder. What does the dragon boy? Oh, have you been talking to Viola Giordano? She posts those all over well, the city. Well, then. Someone keeps taking them down. Ask her about it. If you want an earful. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let's go to the Palace of Kings. Eh, let's go find her.
There you are. Hello. Be on the lookout. The butcher could be around any corner. What can you tell me about this butcher? I've been following him for months now. Well, not actually following. Trying to find him. The guys well, won't help. The people won't help. I'm the only one who thinks he can be caught. I think he can be caught. I found this journal in the killer's lair. Huh? What's it say? It sounds like the court mage has been experimenting. Wunferth. There have been rumors swirling about him for years. As long as I can remember. But he's a dangerous man. That's why they call him the Unliving. I wouldn't approach him directly. This information needs to go straight to the steward. He'll listen to you. But what happens if I do talk to him? Go fiddling with any locks around here. And here we're gonna have a real problem. Blah blah blah. I used to be an adventurer like Hope you. Hope you're happily married. An arrow in the knee. Don't be so sure of that. We've intercepted couriers from Solitude. The Empire's putting a great deal of pressure on the White Run. And what would you have me do? Hmm. Hell of a man. Yolfra told us quite the story. If you made it through all that, you're likely worth something to me. Okay. Now, but first, tell me, why does a foreigner want to fight for Skyrim? Skyrim is home to more than just the Nords. Fair enough. But are you willing to die for your home? That's why I'm here. I want to join. All right. But before I can put you to use, I can handle anything you throw to... at me. That's what I like to. So long as you can back up, I'm sending you to Serpent Stone Island. If you survive, you pass. If you die, well, you weren't going to be much use to me anyway. Okay. Mm it's where men have tested their metal mm for ages. It's a strange rock formation, built by the ancients. Okay. Something about that place attracts the ice raids. You kill an ice raid out there, and I'll have all the proof I need about you. I'm off to kill an ice raid. I'll be back soon. We'll see about that, won't we? Here, take this. You need it. Try and find If he's not with us, he's against us. He knows that. They all know that. How long okay. are you going to wait? I want to speak with this court wizard first. I do the cooking and cleaning around the palace. Nothing wrong with that. It's an honest living. You think I need to send Bold Graf a stronger message? If by message you mean shoving a sword through his gullet. Upstairs? See if I can't find this wizard. Barracks. My living oh my god, Lydia, you're why are you dumb? Hello. Now I remember. I'm the harbinger of the, of the companion. Dare you? So you what? Harbinger. Fetch the meat. More or less. No one. More living quarters. Further upstairs. Don't suppose you'd enchant my sword. I guess this is the Jarl's Donald quarters. No. Nope. Barely cut butter. Hail companion. Damn right. Court wizard's always hard to find for me. Is that just me?
He never seems to be around when you want to see him. <sighs> I never get frustrated on something that gives me a stomach ache. Don't know why. Stress, I guess. Then let them die with their false kings. We've been soldiers a long time. The Stormcloaks are finding victory across the Ali the Killer is your court wizard. That's quite an accusation. I assume you have proof. I don't want to believe it. It pains me to see that Woundfirth shall be apprehended. I, the streets of Windhelm are now safe. Maybe. There's more to it than this. Well put. I guarantee it. Tell me, Godmar. Why do you fight for me? I'd follow you into the depths of oblivion. You know that. Barracks. Yes, but... Why do you fight? If not for me, what then? You, you are I'll coming die before elves are finally going to arrest the butcher. men. Are we not yes, sir. one in this? I want to follow. I'll be of assistance if he gets unruly. He's in the barracks. This is more upstairs. I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long since we've had a good bandit raid. More private quarters. Barracks. Oh no. The gods gave you two hands. There you, you are. Them both for your weapon. He's busy. What is what the is meaning, meaning of yeah, this? Under the arrest for the murder of Susanna of Candlehouth Hall and Frigga Shattershield and all the rest. My heart goes out we to Clan We are your scheming, your Kin coward. Murdered. Family Warhammer stolen. Has the There's whole no fairness city story. lost their brains? I've been Maybe. scrying and auguring to find the murderer myself. Make your excuses from the bloodworks, wizard. Get him out of my sight. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir, but you'll have to come with me. This isn't over, your leg. He went willingly. Not like he had much of a choice. I want the unusual gem. Okay. I know I shouldn't be Ethereum Wars. Uh, small ruins, interesting. Hello. Stay away from the Aretino residence. The place is sure. Cursed. Busy, I see. Whatever. I find your wolfish green unsettling. Oh, I think it's charming. I've been going for a little more than 30 minutes. I can go a little longer. Now, where do I go? Later. Let's go do this one real quick. Uh, or. Hmm. Actually, I don't know. Let's start that one. There it is. Try 
Talos. Forsworn Conspiracy. One of the more fun quest lines. One of the more fun quests. But I don't feel like doing it. Or that. I don't know what I want to do right now. Hmm. Sure, let's go do that. Get some more questing type stuff done. Go to Iverstead. It's the best place to go for it, trust me. Look like a pilgrim. Why bother visiting Iverstead? My reasons are my own. You ever settle down to have children? Think twice wow. before you do it. Oh, you're a traveler. You must have so much to tell about the world outside. This Not world. really. Here I begin my climb up the seven thousand steps. Excuse me on that one. Emblem 1. Before the birth of men, the dragons ruled all Mundus. Their word was the voice, and they spoke only for true needs. For the voice could blot out the sky and flood the land. Say to giant spiders. There's no question when you're using a staff, but you know, if you want to, you can. I don't judge. I didn't miss a tablet, did I? Doesn't look like it. Pretty hard to miss, actually. Just keep climbing up the mountainside with goats. There's another emblem with a hunter. Keep. What do you what want, do you Imperial? Want? Did you... Well, aren't you nice? Did you hear the Greybeards calling Dovakin? I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. What are you doing? I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the enemies. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. Nice. Do you visit the Greybeards? They're not the sort to take visitors, but I never go that high up the path anyway. Some folk who make the trip leave them food or other essentials, but not to make conversation. Okay. All right. Emblem 2. Men were born and spread over the face of Mundus. The dragons persisted over the crawling masses. Men were weak then and had no voice. That guy was a dick. What do you want, Imperial? I'm the frickin' Dragonborn in Dark Brotherhood armor, wielding the axe of Yiskanmor. Cut the attitude. Oh, Ice Ray. Slippery little buggers. Yeah. 
Where did it die? Doesn't matter. Oh. Wolf. Whatever. Just keep on walking. Another emblem. Emblem three. The fledgling spirits of men were strong in old times, unafraid to war with dragons in their voice. But the dragons only shouted them down and broke their hearts. Continue to travel. It's a long trek up the mountain. Another emblem. Keep it. You need something? something? Did you hear the Greybeards calling Dovahkiin? I was just outside Iverstead when it happened. It's an exciting moment. Nothing like this has happened in centuries. No. What are you doing? Wait, who are you? Just a pilgrim. I'd prefer to leave it at that, if you don't mind. To each their own. What are you doing? Walking the steps. Meditating on the emblems. I make this trip every few years. Okay. Until next time. Emblem 4, Kain called on Parthenax, who pitied man. Together, they taught men to use the voice. Then Dragon War raged, dragon against tongue. Onward up through the pass as we continue our trek to the top. And we fight a troll. Boost! Emblem 5. Men prevailed, shouting Alduin out of the world, proving for all that their voice was too strong. Their voice too was strong, although sacrifices were many fold. As we continue, we come across another tablet. Emblem 6. With roaring tongues, the Sky Children conquer, founding the first empire with sword and voice, whilst the dragons withdrew from this world. Emblem 
1207. The tongues at Red Mountain went away humbled. Jorgen Vindkala began his seven-year meditation to understand how strong voices could fail. Emblem 8. Jorgen Vindkaller chose silence and returned. The 17 disputants could not shout him down. Jorgen the Calm built his home on the throat of the world. Trying to tie receptum. Emblem nine. For years, all silent, the graybeard spoke one name, Tiber Septum. Stripping, stripling, then was summoned to Hothgar. They blessed and named him Zobakim. And there's the final emblem on our long trek. Emblem 10. The voice is worship. Follow the inner path. Speak only in true need. The voice of the sky added. This active effect. For 23 hours, animals will neither attack nor flee from you. I can put the supplies in here. Do that later. Hi, Rothgar. So, a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. You call me dragonborn. What does that mean? First, let us see if you truly are dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Okay. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? I was answering your summons, Master. We are honored to welcome a Dragonborn to High Hrothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. What is my destiny? It is for you to discover. We can show you the way, but not your destination. That makes sense. I'm ready to learn. You have shown that you are dragon. But do you have the discipline in temple? Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thumb, a shout. I'm right behind you. Now let us see if you are willing. You and lead, I'll follow. Learn. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your I've got your back. I will remain on guard here. Your ability to learn the words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. This is true. Master Einarth will now teach you Gro, the second word in unrelenting force. Gro means balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. Okay, Fus, Ro.
balance, unrelenting force. You word like a master. You truly do have the gift. But learning a word of power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning through constant practice in order to use it in a shout. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. Right. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Okay. Now, let us see how quickly you can master your new food. Okay. Oh my God, I'm going for almost an hour. Use your unrelenting force shout to strike the target. I don't feel good. I'm tired. I'll finish this. Well, get out of the way. No way for it to recharge, which is nice. Well done. Again. No, he's recharged. One more time. You learn quickly. Once more. Boost roll. And that's it. That's all she wrote. Impressive. No, actually, there's a lot more they wrote. You show great promise, right? You will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Boy. But I think I'll be doing that next time. I'm gonna end this here. Pause. Next time, we're gonna follow Master Bori out to the courtyard and learn and take further more trials. Further more trials. More further trials. I am really tired. And we'll carry out from there. In the meantime, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up, it'll help me out. If you want to see more of this, remember to hit the subscribe and ring the bell. And give me your input. I'd like to see what you can, what can you say about this series? What do you like about it? And I'll keep doing that. Give me some feedback, let me know what you guys think. But until then, I'm the Dark Seraph, signing off.